The 72nd United States Congress was a meeting of the legislative branch of the United States federal government, consisting of the United States Senate and the United States House of Representatives. It met in Washington, D.C. from March 4, 1931, to March 4, 1933, during the last two years of Herbert Hoover's presidency. The apportionment of seats in this House of Representatives was based on the 13th decennial census of the United States in 1910. The Senate had a Republican majority. The House started with a very slim Republican majority, but by the time it first met in December 1931, the Democrats had gained a majority through special elections. <laughs> Major events Ongoing, Great Depression January 12, 1932, Hattie Wyatt Carraway of Arkansas became the first woman elected to the United States Senate. Rebecca Latimer Felton of Georgia had been appointed to fill a vacancy in 1922. The 87-year-old Felton served one day as a senator. Carraway had won a special election to fill the remaining months of the term of her late husband, Senator Thaddeus Carraway. She won re-election to a full term in 1932 and again in 1938 and served in the Senate until January 1945. July 28, 1932, Bonus Army was dispersed. November 8, 1932, United States elections, 1932 United States presidential election, 1932, incumbent Republicans Herbert Hoover and Charles Curtis lost to Democrats Franklin Roosevelt as president, and John Nance Garner as vice president. United States Senate elections, 1932, Democrats gained 12 seats for a 59-36 majority. United States House of Representatives elections, 1932, Democrats gained 97 seats for a 313-117 majority. Major legislation January 22, 1932, Reconstruction Finance Corporation Act, Cess. 1, ch. 847 Stat. 5 March 23, 1932, Norris LaGuardia Act, Cess. 1, ch. 90, 47 Stat. 70 June 6, 1932, Revenue Act of 1932, Cess. 1, ch. 209, 47 Stat. 169 July 22, 1932, Federal Home Loan Bank Act, Cess. 1, ch. 522, 47 Stat. 725 March 3, 1933, By American Act, Cess. 2, ch. 212, Title 3, 47 Stat. 1520 Constitutional amendments March 2, 1932, approved an amendment to the United States Constitution moving the beginning and ending of the terms of the President and Vice President from March 4 to January 20, and of members of Congress from March 4 to January 3, and also establishing what is to be done when there is no President-elect, and submitted it to the state legislatures for ratification. January 23, 1933, the Twentieth Amendment to the United States Constitution was ratified by the requisite number of states then 36 to become part of the Constitution. February 20, 1933, approved an amendment to the U.S. Constitution repealing the Eighteenth Amendment, and submitted it to state ratifying conventions for ratification. Amendment was later ratified on December 5, 1933, becoming the 21st Amendment to the United States Constitution. Topic: <laughs> Party summary. The count below identifies party affiliations at the beginning of the first session of this Congress and includes members from vacancies and newly admitted states when they were first seated. Changes resulting from subsequent replacements are shown below in the Changes in Membership section. Topic: Senate. Topic: House of Representatives. Topic: Leadership. <laughs> 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 
Topic: Senate. President: Charles Curtis R. President pro tempore: George H. Moses R. Topic: Majority Republican. Majority Leader: James E. Watson. Majority Whip: Simeon D. Fess. Republican Conference Secretary: Frederick Hale. Topic: Minority Democratic. Minority Leader: Joseph T. Robinson. Minority Whip: Morris Shepard. Democratic Caucus Secretary: Hugo Black. Topic: House of Representatives. Speaker, John N. Garner, D. Topic: Majority Democratic. Majority Leader, Henry T. Rainey. Majority Whip, John McDuffie. Democratic Caucus Chairman, William W. Arnold. Democratic Campaign Committee Chairman, Joseph W. Burns Sr. Topic: Minority Republican. Minority Leader: Bertrand H. Snell. Minority Whip: Carl G. Bachman. Republican Conference Chair: Willis C. Hawley. Topic: Members. This list is arranged by chamber, then by state. Senators are listed by class, and representatives are listed by district. Topic: <inaudible> Senate. Senators were elected every two years, with one third beginning new six-year terms with each Congress. Preceding the names in the list below are Senate class numbers, which indicate the cycle of their election. In this Congress, Class I meant their term began in the last Congress, requiring re-election in 1934, Class II meant their term began with this Congress, requiring re-election in 1936, and Class III meant their term ended with this Congress, requiring re-election in 1932. <laughs> House of Representatives The names of members of the House of Representatives elected statewide on the general ticket or otherwise at large, are preceded by an at large, and the names of those elected from districts, whether plural or single member, are preceded by their district numbers. <laughs> <laughs> Changes in membership <laughs> Senate. Replacements, 8 No net gains for either party Deaths, 6 Resignations, 3 Interim appointments, 4 Total seats with changes, 11 <laughs> House of Representatives Replacements, 23 Democratic, 6 seat net gain Republican, 6 seat net loss Deaths, 24 Resignations, 7 Contested election, 1 Total seats with changes, 32 Committees Lists of committees and their party leaders, for members House and Senate of the committees and their assignments, go into the official congressional directory at the bottom of the article and click on the link five links. In the directory after the pages of Terms of Service, you will see the committees of the Senate, House standing with subcommittees, select and special and joint and after the committee pages, you will see the House, Senate committee assignments in the directory, on the committees section of the House and Senate in the official congressional directory, the committee's members on the first row on the left side shows the chairman of the committee and on the right side shows the ranking member of the committee. <inaudible> <inaudible> Joint committees 
Conditions of Indian Tribes special. Disposition of useless executive papers The Library Taxation Veterans Affairs Caucuses Democratic House Democratic Senate Topic Employees Architect of the Capitol, David Lynn Attending Physician of the United States Congress, George Calver Controller General of the United States, John R. McCarl Librarian of Congress, Herbert Putnam Public Printer of the United States, George H. Carter <laughs> Senate Chaplain, Zebarney T. Phillips, Episcopalian. Secretary, Edwin P. Thayer. Sergeant at Arms, David S. Berry. Democratic Party Secretary, Edwin A. Halsey. Republican Party Secretary, Carl A. Loeffler. <laughs> House of Representatives Chaplain, James S. Montgomery, Methodist. Clerk, South Trimble Doorkeeper, Joseph J. Sinnott Parliamentarian, Louis Deschler Postmaster, Finnis E. Scott Reading Clerks, Patrick Joseph Haltigan D. and N. A. R. Sergeant at Arms, Kenneth Romney See also List of members of the United States House of Representatives in the 72nd Congress by seniority List of United States Senators in the 72nd Congress by seniority United States elections, 1930 elections leading to this Congress United States Senate elections, 1930 and 1931 United States House of Representatives elections, 1930 United States elections, 1932 elections during this Congress, leading to the next Congress United States presidential election, 1932 United States Senate elections, 1932 United States House of Representatives elections, 1932